Another week on the quest towards CCIE enterprise infrastructure is in the books. Let me tell you how it went. So here we go again another week on my quest towards the ccie journey is in the books how did it go what went on let's talk about it again if this is your first time visiting my channel and you'd like to grow your it skills and your it career click that subscribe and little bell so you get notified when new content comes available all right how did this week go for me well first things first i shipped off my 3750g switch all the way to brazil congratulations to the winner of last week's giveaway now i am going to do more giveaways later because i do have a lot of equipment still just sitting here and there. I'm looking at a stack of switches right now. I want to get rid of these Juniper switches and I want to get rid of that Meraki switch too. So keep your eyes peeled in the coming weeks because I will be giving that stuff away. I need to clear the space out of my room. All right, cool. So how did this week go when it comes to studying and prepping for CCIE? Uh, it was good. There were some things, you know, here, here's the deal. I can't really talk about what I'm working on right now. I am going to talk about it in a week or two, hopefully, as long as progress gets made in the way that I'm really hoping for. But during the mornings, just like I mentioned last week, during the mornings, I'm spending my time focused on a particular topic on the CCIE lab exam, and I'm recording content too for that particular topic. I did run into a hardware compatibility issue this week, and I've had to order new switches. I talked about that a lot on Twitter. Uh, I've got two Catalyst 3850s on the way to me. They should be delivered hopefully over the weekend, uh, maybe by Monday at the latest, at which point I'll be able to progress on and break through the really big things that I've got on my plate. So I'm hoping that by mid next week, I've broken through all of the core topics that I really need to focus on for the exam and get that stuff recorded and uploaded to CBT Nuggets. Now on the other side of things, I am continuing my plan where I'm reading the NRC textbook and focusing on the core subjects of routing and services in the evening. Here we go right here, this monster of a book, the OCG for the NRC exam. I'm a little over halfway now through with this book. I'm on the chapter on route redistribution. So I've gotten through the routing protocols and I've gotten through policy-based routing, route maps, prefix lists, and things like that. So uh, feeling good about this so far. I was already feeling pretty good about the routing protocols. I do think I need to brush up on OSPF a little more. OSPF in this book goes really, really deep. And I've been really impressed by reading this book, at, at least on those topics there. So I'm going to progress through the end of this book. Hopefully it's been a lot of time in the lab focusing on things like DMVPN or MPLS Layer 3 VPN. Keith Barker's training on those items, I don't think it can be topped. So I'm going to watch those CBT nuggets one more time just to really drill those items down. I've already got a lab set up in EVNG that's going to help me get through MPLS Layer 3 VPN as well as DMVPN as well. So I know the big thing that's on your mind is what is it that I'm working on? What is the big spoiler? What is a tease? Anything. Uh, again, what I can tell you is that it does go towards the CCIE objective. So that's one thing that you can narrow your focus down on too. Uh, but that is, you know, now the CCIE exam itself is pretty broad in what it covers. So it could be still a lot of those different things. The other thing that I'll say is I'm working on it with Jeff Kish and Keith Barker, two people that I think are just absolutely the best to work with. I'm so happy that they're on this journey with me because they support me in so many different ways. But beyond that, I think this course is going to be really well-rounded because at the end of the day, they're really good instructors and they're really good at teaching the things that they're going to be teaching in this upcoming course. So to recap how the week went, I spent the mornings working on the course that I can't talk about. I did run into a little bit of a wall and I'm waiting on some more hardware to come in. I cannot wait to tell you guys about what that wall is. I, I just, I really need someone to talk to about it because it was, it was a real doozy and I had to do a lot of troubleshooting that was really, really fun and it really dove deep into the technologies themselves. So hang tight. We'll get that announcement out there soon. You're going to love it, I promise. And then I finished up the evenings by reading the core routing and services textbook. And once I'm done with that, I'm going to move on to boson practice exams to drill those concepts home, as well as moving on to the CCIE textbooks, routing TCP IP, and the CCIE route switch textbooks that were for version 5. So that's been my week. Week and recap. Thanks for stopping by, y'all. I'll see you in the next one.